The rapid development of Smart Grid in recent years has brought power grid and communications technologies closer as the transport network becomes the main artery for the power distribution network. Achieving this convergence entails overcoming several challenges. Bandwidth requirements from grid services are increasing. As upgraded video surveillance and office automation systems are added, the conventional 2.5G, 10G MSTP deployment in combined power distribution and communication networks has become the bottleneck to restricting business development. Regardless of how well business develops, reliability and security will always remain the top priority for power grid operations. The power industry will always be focused on those technologies able to solve the bottlenecks in business development and provide the needed level of reliability and security. Observing the overall situation, no single piece of technology can adapt to the diversity requirements of the power grid. The current industry trend is to converge optical transport technology. Enter Enhanced MSTP. So what does this tech have that conventional MSTP does not? The maximum bandwidth on the line side of conventional MSTP is 10G, while that of Enhanced MSTP is 40G. Scalable to 80G in the future. Conventional 40G WDM solutions must fully consider optical power, dispersion tolerance, and OSNR. In contrast, 40G smart line cards use the new PID technology, achieving transmission distances of 80 kilometers with plug and play convenience and no need for optical layer design. In traditional layouts, all low-speed services have to be aggregated to PCM equipment, then sent to the transmission equipment. PCM boards are inserted into the enhanced MSTP devices, integrating optical and electrical transmission and achieving unified service access for low-speed devices. Enhanced MSTP enhances network reliability simplifies O&M and saves floor space in the equipment room. ASIN provides the best protection against impact to services from multiple fiber cuts. However, power production largely uses 2 megabit per second service bearers on generally different paths. For example, relay protection might be done at an adjacent substation, while stability and security assurances might be executed between the substation and the dispatch center. In conventional ASON, each service type requires a separate VC4 channel, adding tremendous strain to any resources. If segmented VC4 channels are deployed, services would be left unprotected in the event of an NE failure. 2 megabit per second ASON achieves end-to-end -end assurances for each service and avoids interruptions from node and link failures while saving VC4 resources. The layout completely suits the purposes of the power grid industry. In conventional approaches, MSTP and relay protection devices are connected, but optical and electrical modules are separated, requiring optical and electrical conversion modules to be placed between the devices. This increases management costs and adds another point susceptible to failure. Enhanced MSTP provides 2 megabit per second optical ports that can be directly connected to relay protection equipment from mainstream vendors. Conversion modules are not needed, significantly improving the reliability and O&M efficiency of the network. Enhanced MSTP incorporates multiple advancements to the traditional MSTP layout. Enhanced MSTP will play a larger role in the power grid industry as the Internet of Energy continues to develop.